Hello, and welcome to Cruising Off Duty. So what is the channel Cruising Off Duty all about? We wanted to show you how we enjoy our cruising sailboat and how it gets us away from the hustle and bustle of everyday life and gets rid of the stress. That's me, Craig, and that's my wife, Janice. Although we just finished filming the first season of Cruising Off Duty, it's actually our sixth year with this boat. In this first season, we talk about things like why a cruising sailboat is better than a cottage, how much work is a cruising sailboat, and how easy was it for us to buy our sailboat in North Carolina and ship it here. That's our boat right there. We called it Off Duty. It's a Beneteau 351. The Ottawa River is a beautiful river to sail on, and I love doing videography and drone videography. It's beautiful to see an anchorage from your boat, but it's even more beautiful to see it from the air. So one thing I show you is how I take off and land from a moving sailboat. It can be interesting at times. So the drone I use for most of this season is a Q500. That's what you see Terry catching right there. And it's taken awesome 4K footage of all the different anchorages I've been at over the last season. But this winter, us and two other couples are gonna rent a catamaran to sail around in the BBI. And I certainly couldn't bring that big drone with me. So of course, I'm gonna make episodes about us sailing around the BBI, but I needed a drone I could bring with me. Out comes the Mavic Pro, a drone so small it fits in your hand. So I got that drone right at the end of the season. Let's hear what I thought of it. This little drone, which I can fold up and make much smaller than it is than it looks right now, is going to change everything. <laughs> I'm gonna bring this thing with me everywhere I go, oh, yeah. just on the off chance that I need to fly a drone. <laughs> you never know when you'll need to fly a drone. So we've had a great time sailing around the Ottawa River, but what's going on in the future on Cruising Off Duty? Well, this season we let everyone know that our plan is to sell everything, the house, the cars, everything, and buy a catamaran and sail around the world. If you've watched the episodes, you know that Janice hates winter. I mean, really hates winter. So it wasn't hard to make her fall for the idea of living on a catamaran and living in an environment like this, where we can walk on pristine beaches and go scuba diving or snorkeling right off the back of our boat. So even though those plans are a few years down the road, we thought no time like the present to start window shopping. It's more of the game of, what would we buy if we had this much money or this much money? And that meant we went to the Annapolis Boat Show and made three episodes about what our favorite catamarans are now. For anyone thinking of getting a catamaran down the road, I highly suggest those episodes. So that's what's gonna happen in cruising off duty down the road, but what's gonna happen next season? Next season, we are extremely excited to know that we're moving our boat from the Ottawa River to the Thousand Islands area of the St. Lawrence River. That borders Lake Ontario with big cities like Toronto right at our fingertips. This gives us limitless water to explore, and we can't wait, except for we wanna stay out of the way of these things. So that pretty much tells you what we've been up to last season, what we're gonna be up to next season, and what's gonna happen in the future with Cruising Off Duty. So we hope you'll watch, and if you haven't done so already, we hope you'll subscribe so you don't miss an episode in the future. If you're enjoying Cruising Off Duty, and you'd like to support the channel, please go to patreon.com slash cruisingoffduty. By supporting us there, you'll become a member of our crew and all the rewards that go along with it. With your support, we'll be able to make episodes into the indefinite future. Hopefully you become a crew member, but even if you don't, we still appreciate you watching and of course giving us a thumbs up. Thanks a lot.